have done with the configurations of the asset under construction. OK, we have done with the asset under construction and we have posted. A, uh, OK, so can you uh, give the one more thing that we have posted? That is a uh, C C point. Manu in the Coca entry post is in the fry charges entry posting using transaction code FB01. Fry charges uh, entry postings using transaction code. No one go to the fry charges and any manu. Uh, I mean. Uh, asset account data to the bank account jsmu in the fry charges to scott leather and they are the asset under construction is in process are they and the country person on a main bank account and the compulsory get this call that is very very important okay so using transaction code afb01 the next point is here fifth point here is settlement of asset under construction to the main asset settlement of asset under construction settlement of asset under construction asset under construction to the main asset to the main asset using transaction code ai ab using transaction code ai ab so we will going to create our uh, main asset okay we will going to create our main asset can you go to the transaction code as01 once again can you go to the transaction code as01 can you go to the transaction code as01 Okay. Okay. So AS01. All right. Uh, so asset classes, asset classes, our uh, main asset class that we have created. Okay. Uh, yes, plant and machinery classes. That is oil refinery classes. Oil refinery classes. OK, so asset under construction. Oh, no, 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 no. This is main asset. OK, remove this thing. We have already uh, have that uh, asset under construction class. Uh, sorry, asset, right? Now it is a main asset. We are transferring this uh, asset under construction total amount to the particular main asset. OK, got it uh, here. Fourth oil machinery. Fourth oil machinery AUC main asset. Fourth oil machinery AUC main asset. Mastery AOC main asset and asset main number text is same thing. OK, can you come down and the capitalization date is. Uh, uh, change the capitalization date to 10.11.2022 10.11.2022. Why? Because we have already have the asset reconstruction and fry charges and all that is why I'm not uh, taking the 01.11.2022 okay then go to the depreciation areas take out the slm methods go to the depreciation areas and take out the slm methods uh, give the useful life of the assets is uh, four years same thing can you click on the enter go to the c button and save it click on the enter Go to the save button and save it. OK, go to the uh, notepad and note down the asset number five. Note down the asset. number. OK. Yes, now you can just go to the new uh, go to the transaction code AW01N slash and AW01N. We have created the new asset, right? See, there is no any balances. OK, you got the thing. There is no any balances. OK, now you can just go to the transaction code uh, AIAB. Or else we do one thing for one. OK, check with the asset under construction process. Uh, AW01N. Go to the AW01N. Ah, take out the asset. Uh, go to the drop down option. Go to the asset under construction. I think so. 101. Huh? Mm, 101. Take out the 101. No, no, no. 101. 101. Ah. This is our main class, right? Uh, click on the enter. 
Okay, now you got the thing right. And uh, yes, uh, take out the that uh, asset only. Okay, remove this asset uh, 101 and take out the fifth asset. Take out the fifth asset. So now we are uh, seeing the. Uh, okay, now we are entering the uh, what is the thing? Ah, yes, can you go to the transaction code AAB settlement of uh, certain reconstruction AIAB? Go to the transaction code AIAB. <clears throat> okay, can you take out the asset power uh, here? Uh, that asset is 101, I think. So go to the drop down option. Go to the drop down option. Take out the asset hmm, 101. Whatever the settling asset that we are doing, and that should be mentioned in this asset only. Okay. So now what you need to do is can you click on the enter go to the execute button. Mm. Go to the execute button. Now we are settling this uh, 31,000 rupees amount to the particular main asset. OK, so that is main thing. So can you select all these transactions? There is a select button go up uh, select button. So that is the main important thing that is the select option or else you can just go to this uh, uh, edit option edit option go up edit. Edit. Uh, pop edit. Uh, select and select all options. Okay. So can you deselect it? If you don't find out the select options and all. Okay. Go to the edit option and select all these things. Okay. Then next, what we need to do is we have to enter the distribution rules, right? And we have uh, uh, taken the distributions rules for the uh, particular asset and reconstruction. So, so can you go to the enter option? Uh, go to the enter option. Uh, yes. Now what we need to do is we have to set in this uh, uh, line items, right? The category is fixed assets, FXA. So you have seen that thing in a settlement period. Can you take out this thing, FXA, that is asset? OK. Who is the settlement receiver? Can you open that thing? Who is the settlement receiver? Can you open that thing? Uh, can you take out the five? I think five, right? Yes, take out that. And what is the percentage? What is the percentage? Uh, 100 percentage, I think so. 100 percentage. Hundred percent. Can you click on the enter? Go on. Enter. Okay. Can you one step back? One step back. You will going to see the uh, green buttons. Okay. Now you got the thing right. So it should be in a green button. If it is in a uh, red status and all, okay, this uh, asset will not be transferred. That is very very important point. Okay. So now what we need to do is, can you go to the settlement? Settlement. Yes. Save changes to distribution rules. Yes. OK, give me one second. And once we are done with the uh, this settlement and all now what we need to do is and asset value date. You have to give the asset value date and all. OK, uh, so what is the asset value date here? Uh, 10 dot 10. No, no, no. 10 dot 11 dot 2022. I think so. This is our capitalization date, right? I think so. OK, and the text is asset under construction. Asset under construction. Settlement. Asset under construction. Settlement. Asset under construction settlement. OK, and can you remove the test run also? Can you remove the text run also? OK, can you click on the enter? Click on the enter. A number range interval company code KN, KN ID is not defined for uh, account document type EA. Uh -huh. 
can you go up uh, can you go to this thing okay the number range is not defined for this document type define the number range in financial accounting why okay can you go to the create new session can you go to the create new session uh go to the create new session uh go to the no 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 uh okay kp uh go to the okay kp and you have to remove that thing okay asset accounting settlement process go to the position and give your controlling area hmm click on the enter take out that one and go to the activate components controls indicators okay, double click on this thing uh, yes remove the activate type go to the sub button and set it to the sub button and set it and i think this is for the number range information okay come back come back uh, give slash n no issue give slash n why it is throwing an error go to the aab transaction code i think go to that uh, uh, close this all these sessions close all these sessions phone close all these sessions Okay. Yes. Ah. Oh, okay. Right. Uh, so A A B. Go to the transaction code A A B. Hmm. Right. Once again, go to the transaction code A A B. User ID and password. Hmm. Go to the transaction code A A B. Ah. Oh, click on the enter and uh, give the company code and give the asset. Asset. Mm. 101 101 no 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 101 we have to settle that asset go click on the enter go to the execute button uh. now we have to settle these things i think we have settled all these things can you go to the enter option go to the enter option here ah uh. uh. select line items i think it is in a okay selecting one okay you need uh, what you need to do is can you go to the settlement settlement i think it is in a green color mark option okay uh, then next give uh, asset value date is uh, 10.11.2022 10.11 uh, uh, remove the uh, okay give the text allocation and remove the test run and remove the test run hmm. click on the enter we will going to see whether the system is throwing an error number range interval in company code knd is not defined for document type uh, e Can you go to the create new session and go to the transaction code OB A seven. Ah, OB A seven. OB A seven. Ah, go to the asset accounting. No, no, no. Asset postings A. Double click on this asset postings. Ah, uh, go to the number range information. Ah, uh, give the company code. Ah, uh, go to the intervals. Ah, uh, what is the number range information? Sixteen. Okay, we don't have any sixteen here, so that is why it is throwing an error. Twelve hundred, twelve zero one two, thirteen hundred. Click on the enter, go to the save button, and save it. Okay. Yeah. Can you give slash in? Give slash in here. Okay. Now what we need to do is here there is a document type, right? I think so. Okay. Ah, uh, go to the execute button. No issue. Mm, compiling. so it is uh, getting some values and all okay now you got the thing right 31000 has been posted to the main asset and this asset transaction posted with the document number 1201 can you go to the asset settlement asset under construction settlement document go to the notepad and write down the asset under construction settlement document is asset under construction settlement document is no uh, document is hmm what is the document that we have posted uh, ro night, uh, ro uh, write down that number also
Okay, good. Then what is the document? Settlement document number. Okay, go to that uh, screen. Settlement document number is one zero one, right? Uh, uh -huh. one two zero one. No, no, here with the document number is one two zero one. Here only. That is asset one zero one is asset under construction. Here come down. You have seen the asset under transaction posted with document number one two zero one. Okay, take out that number. In the notepad, uh, take out that number as one two zero one. One two zero one. Mm. Go to the transaction. Go to the create new session. Go to the transaction code. Go to the tra transaction code FB zero three. We will going to see it. FB zero three. Mm. Take out the document number. Ah, click on the enter now issue. Enter. Now you got the thing right. Thirty one thousand has been generated to the. I mean, has been transferred to the particular main asset and all. Now we will going to see it. Okay. Can you give slash in and go to the AW zero one N transaction code? Yes. Now there is no any amount. You can just observe yourself with these things, and you can just three thirty one thousand line items retirement transfer for the current year. So what is the main asset? Can you go to that uh, transaction code? Sorry, can you go to that uh, asset? Hmm, asset only. Yes, go up, go up, go up. Hmm, take out that asset. Hmm, take out that asset. Hmm, can you click on the enter? Now you got the thing right. Now you have seen the depreciation postings also. This one we can call it as a asset under construction complete retirement process using transaction code A A B. Okay, all of you. Okay, Pawan, have you got the thing under? Right. Okay, no issue. I will going to stop this recording here.